right, well, the last four days on and off, I have been having severe toothache to the point where it's from here, right away through my ear, right away to the top of my head ear, like, like a needle being stuck right away through. It's bloody agony. Uh, paracetamol, two paracetamol would last, would take away the pain, well, dull the pain, not even take it away, but dull it for about an hour two at the max and then it was bloody painful again so I couldn't I, I was I couldn't take enough paracetamol to obtain to take too much so I've hung up the first thing this morning and uh, luckily I've got an appointment there was a cancellation so I've been able to get in at 20 to 11 and then so you know, just need to put a, it's, it's a fill-in that uh, that that came out um, a, a few uh, in June, and we had a six monthly checkup on um, about, around about the twentieth, but they can't fit us in. It's three months until they can do it because of all the COVID rules. So anyway, hopefully they'll be able to pack it again today, and then uh, and it lasted about six weeks, so it'll get me nearly there then. So because we've got the twentieth, I think the twentieth of September, the the appointment was booked in to actually put the filling in. Anyway. So, what a day yesterday. I'll tell you, here's a forecast. Banks are conning people or, or making it very difficult for anybody who's in a very good position that I'm in that I've actually took a bounce back loan and realised that I didn't need it in the end um, and I went to pay it back. They try everything to stop you doing it. To point blank lying to you. Yeah, the questions you asked me, he said... Uh, um, when's the last time you used your debit card? And I said it was um, at um, uh, on Monday uh, for sixteen pounds at um, at at B and M. He goes, no, I want one that you've done on the phone. I said, okay. The last one I did on the phone was um, it was um, two hundred and fifty eight pounds, and it was for the name of the company and it was yesterday on the on the third or when it was and they said and what time was that I said time I said you never asked me time before I said in fact I said I, I don't know you, I said, if you ask me the second question because they always ask you two questions if to verify well if you can't answer one they ask you another two after that to verify he said I oh, know there's only one question you've got to get it right I said so you're telling me I have to give you the exact time and they said yes I said well here's a question for you you went to the toilet on Monday. What time was it? Did you went? And they said oh, that's not immaterial. We need to think. Anyway, long story short, um, he was telling me that I. Uh, it's too, this is too boring to tell you actually, <laughs> but in the end, for a technicality, because he told me that I, I, I needed to know how much, because this is why he wouldn't let me go ahead. How much I wanted to pay off, and I wanted. He need, I needed to know the monthly amount I paid. And in the end, I just by chance found out the information. It's a long story. This is too boring, too boring. And I'm in too much pain. I'm all right, I'm all right. I'm a man, I'm a bloke, I'm a fella. So anyway, I'm not going to talk about on. I'll tell you, all you guys who come down and see me, that's most of you. And then over the people who don't, I, I, one day, hopefully you will. So anyway, I am waffling now. And I'm time to say goodbye.